Hey everybody, Brian with you from the game coming. We're playing more Thronebreaker. We are what? Second to last episode, I think. So we wanted to we gotta hit that and we gotta hit that one up. So let's go ahead and move through here and the conscription post and all this and uh, we'll see if it has anything. Hopefully there's not gonna be any major battles. Hopefully this is just like a you know little quick easy thing. Like, hey, yeah, there we go. My queen found a sizable store of gold under the floorboards of the dwelling. Uh, take it, bear us, than the looter. Sure, I want the card. I don't really care if that makes people unhappy. <laughs> We're already tyrannical. Whatever. Doesn't matter. So let's go grab this. I don't know if we already did this one. Yeah, that was one of the battles that we fought. Nothing is here. I don't care about you. So where is this other thing that was over here then? Just right up here. Okay. Well, let's go grab the two things to the side. This one and this one. And then we'll, let's go take this encampment. Uh, I just left a small gift which should ease the forts recaptured. Do not delay the attack. The queen will slowly reach the border. By striking from the rear, we can spare the burden on our troops. Secure the hideout's entrance. I don't believe the black lads are on the trail. So, are they telling me to flank it? Can I flank it? Can I flank it? Doesn't look like it. Unless I went all the way over here. Screw it. I have the troops. The only reason I'd want to flank is if it would be like a one <laughs> round instead of a standard, which is probably going to be standard. Yeah, uh, so the dude was impatient to finish his duty and watch. He first planned to empty his batter. He wished to empty his bottle of hooch hidden under his bunk. Unfortunately, he hadn't time to fulfill either desire, so he sounded the alarm. Let's go. Oh, I hate standard battles, man. <laughs> I hate them. I wish we had our mage chick. I wish we still had her. Oh, well. Oh, well. So, we don't want you. We don't need the doggy, for sure. We don't want reinforcement, and we don't want... And I'm probably going to reinforce... I don't know. I kind of want to reinforce those other guys. Uh, let's get rid of the ale as well. I think I'm going to... Oh, man, we have so many bad cards in our hand. Yeah, we got to do this. Man, that's like all our rerolls. Just get rid of all these crappy cards in our hand. Hey, sweet. We'll probably should try shuffling him back in before the end of the match. Um, is going to be the hope. So let's go ahead and play you out. Put the dwarf back because I don't need you yet. Uh, and honestly, I kind of feel like we just do slingers. Nah, because we can pull back any of these guys. So give me you, give me you. We can pull them back next round. So, why would we use the slingers? After two hours of pure boost by self. Well, we can't really do anything to you yet. If we would have had this guy out, we could have, but it's not like he was going to do that much damage, anyways. Um. I think give me a slinger. Because I'm assuming he's about to play three cards, or an extra two cards, because it's usually what happens. Or not. Huh. And then... Yeah, let's just clear him. I'm cool with that. And we might as well get the other slinger out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this is where we want to stay, ideally. Is he gonna pass? No, one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven. He'll stay here then. We did draw a card though. Nice. Uh so two, four, six, eight. Playing another slinger is kind of worthless. So I'm just gonna play the cav. Because we can we can use the slinger next round. And we'll pull back, I think, our Pathfinder. Cause I like the idea of drawing cards. Do I really want to waste it on him? Because I could use the door three times. Potentially four. I think we good. I think we good. I think we save for the dwarf. Our dwarf man is so powerful. I think we just keep it that way. Fire, I'm okay with. The Ballista, we needed. Yeah. And we only have one shuffle, so we'll use it on... Uh... Him. Oh, we never used this! Oh my god. 
<laughs> Whoops. Oh, whoopsie. Uh, that was a problem. <laughs> Whoops. Might have screwed that one up. Might have screwed that up. We lost three extra guys because of that screw up. Whoopsie. I could shuffle him back, though. Do we pull the dwarf out right now? Wise choice. Yeah, because we want reinforcements. Yeah, so let's do this. I'm going to start with catapult. I'm going to shuffle you back. Let's get my dwarf. Probably Arnolf. I love Arnolf. He's such a good card. Yeah. Yeah, I'm cool with this. So then we play you out. Let's get the double trinkets. Oh, it's three trinkets. Where's reinforcements? Oh, it's in my freaking hand. Mm, so many misplays. So many misplays. I didn't realize it was in my freaking hand. Oh my god. That's so annoying. <laughs> uh. Bring it on. Let's get you guys out. God, that was such a waste, man. So, uh, who do we want to kill? Every turn, damage the highest power enemy by five of its power is an even number. The highest damage right now is 15, so no. We'll go for this guy, because he does two damage every turn. We can do that. And we'll keep you, because it doesn't really matter. And I'm going to go play Trinket Guy. Oh, we already played a card. Never mind. God, I misplayed this so bad. Yeah, we still got plenty of space, so we don't really have to worry about um, him yet. We're going to be able to do a lot of damage now with these guys, though. Because this is... I need to add more of these guys to my deck. I keep forgetting. What do you do? You're immune. Because that's uh, six, right? Three, four, five, six. Each turn. Oh, that... Yeah, I was worried about that. Dang. That sucks. Yeah, that sucks. I have to do it that way. Hmm. Let's go play you. Let's get our trinket. Good. I was hoping for this trinket. So let's bring you back. And we'll instantly kill probably whoever comes out. Probably should go ahead and use the rune stone at some point here, too. Do probably need to instantly kill this guy, right? For your bow, anything. And once again, we have to do damage to ourselves, which is so stupid. This is okay. Yeah, I got a plan. So, uh, what's going to happen is we'll probably end up shuffling the guy to bring these guys back out. I think it's kind of where we want to go. So, I'm going to put as many guys in the graveyard as possible. So that we can get them back out. You guys just go whack him. There's no reason not to. Um, you can do one damage. I'm gonna have to finish off once again here, which is so stupid. I wish I could just not attack. <laughs> uh, why do you make me attack when there's no one to attack? Ever have a storm, knock out one of your teeth. Ever have a storm, knock out one of your teeth. Uh, we also should have, I should have used this one. I don't know why I'm waiting. To get you back up on HP. So you're at three. Might as well just do that. Okay. Yeah. Do we already play all our cards? We did. He's at four. I got four cards too. We're about to shuffle. So what do we need?
Who do we want to shuffle back in the deck is a better question. I think let's shuffle you back in the deck. And we want to re-grab him. And we're going to grab you. So this is going to give us a lot of these guys. And then we're going to go ahead and re-pull back Gabor. We're good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we're at 16 right now. So we might need to clear some of these cards out. And I'm going to leave you. Oh, I got to play one extra card, don't I? Dang. Urgh. I don't really want to play a card. <laughs> I don't want to play a card. We don't have any slots. So we want to kill some of these guys off. Oh, they already win, so they don't get any additional. Oh, that sucks. Okay, no, they do. I was actually hoping to kill him. We're going to do that right away. Just to clear up slots. And might as well just play you out and kill you. Doesn't really matter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we can play you out twice. Yeah, okay. This works. So we should go Gabber this turn no matter what. You should have that. And do the 20 damage. And apparently we gotta hit our own guys again, because it's annoying, but whatever. Doesn't really matter. And we will bring back Gabor and then kill with Gabor. We could also play the fire, too. We don't even need Gabber, man. We really don't even need Gabber, do we? We don't even need freaking Gabber, man. Uh, 238 to nothing. Well, that works. And we still have so much damage potential on the board, which is just hilarious. Absolutely funny. All right, well, there you go. Standard battles, boring. <laughs> Freaking boring, we have such a good deck. So, uh, let's go ahead and maybe... I feel like, um... Hold up, let me finish all this crap. Oh, what, we finished you. All right, let's, whoopsie, wrong button. There's nothing over here. Yeah, so all we got left is over there. And then we got the final battle. So what I think I'm going to do is I want to get rid of one of our slingers. I don't think we want as many slingers anymore. And I think instead... I'm going to put all five in. Part of me is like, well, we could roll with four, but why not roll with five? Because I love reinforcing, refor reinforcing with them. They don't have resilience, right? I'm not playing this wrong. Where they at? Ballista. No. Man, if they had reinforcement... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Think of how much damage... Like, we could put them out in round one and just, like... <laughs> destroy in standard battles. More than we're already destroying in standard battles. So, really, there's only a couple kind of, like, random decks that we'll fight that are going to give us any sort of trouble. Everything else is just going to be absolute Broadhead domination. Broadhead now loomed before Meave and her force. Broadhead? Once hmm. famous for its glowing forges and clanking manufactories, the city now stood silent. Why, you might ask. Because? Mahakam. What? Decades passed, it had opened its gates to human merchants and dwarven arms. Exquisitely crafted and not nearly as dear as those made by man. The caravans had simply stopped coming to Broadhead. Okay. When its black-clad garrison spotted the Lyrians approaching, they'd hastily fled, left the city's gates open wide. Yet, they did not leave empty-handed. Their convoy comprising at least a dozen wagons loaded ostensibly to the hilt. With what might they have fled? With something damn heavy, replied Gascon, squinting his eyes. Look at this. Two horses to pull each wagon, and the wheels cut deep into the road. Hmm. Take the sea without a fight? I'm gonna pursue what them. they've taken from my city, began the queen. They've taken from me. 
and I will have it back. I mean, we're going vengeance pure spurred her horse and galloped off and in simple of the fleeing caravan. When the black clouds oh. realized they had no hope of escape, they planted pikes and feet. All right, let's go. Uh, shorten, please. Yay. So we felt a pounding blow enough. Guardian arrow had struck her breastplate. Fortunately, the plate was sturdy, shattering the missile on impact, leaving the queen unharmed. Yet if the archer's aim had been true, if the arrow had struck a few inches higher, me broke into a cold sweat. If true, the war neared its end, but only constant vigilance can ensure it would not be premature. Okay. So, uh, we need reinforcements, we need the dwarf, and we need a catapult. And if we can't get all three, it's fine. I don't care about you. I definitely don't want double cav. I also don't care about Ek. You're probably fine. Yeah. Gascon. So we could actually... Oh, snap. I forgot he's plus now. We never really use his plus. I think I roll with this. I mean, this card's kind of crap. There's a dwarf. This is pretty much everything we want. <laughs> like, there's really no other cards we want. Whatever you carry belongs to me. They gain growth. Dull safer. So we need this guy dead. All right, that actually works really well for us. That also works okay. Although I can't use you this turn. So... I could play out the dwarf right now. I think I would rather just get two slingers instead. Yeah, let's do this. Reinforcement. We'll do that. We'll shuffle the cabin. Because, whatever, I could care less. He doesn't actually attack, so... <laughs> I think I'm going to grab two slingers right away. We could also get the Pathfinder so we could draw cards. Is there, uh... Is he going to draw cards if he's losing? Damage an ally, uh, enemy by the number of unit, allied units. So he's going to do a lot of damage this next turn. I think instead... Give me two slingers. Because we can kill off quite a bit of his... They are, they are quite a bit of what he has right now. Actually, we can kill off everything he has. GG. And now he's not going to do anything. But yeah. That's how you freaking play. A first turn, man. Really, dog? Really? Whatever. It's fine. In the scheme of things, it's fine. And anything that gets played out is just going to straight die. Yeah, I mean, there's really nothing that they can do to stop me. Think I'm a bear. I'm a bear. I'm a bear. And as long as it keeps playing out at 12, that's just perfect, because then I don't have to, like, actually damage myself. So, thank you. And we do want the Pathfinder at this point, just so we can keep extra cards, so we can go after him. Two, four, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we also lost a card because... Um, the doggy. But he lost one, I guess, because we made him dismiss. Two, four, six. Yeah, we're equal then. Uh, and I guess this is going to put us back to six, too, so, sure. I don't really want to use our dwarf until it's absolutely necessary. Might as well play you out. Not that we need it. <laughs> Not that we need it. Should also play Arnold. Not that we need it. Oh, no. We have to do damage to ourselves now. How dare you. He did one whole damage. He did one whole freaking damage. How dare you. Oh, we didn't play a card. What? Arnolf. Wanna know why I got my scar? Not really. Can you please bring better cards? Like, seriously? Uh... I mean, I'm at the point where... We don't really want to play any of these cards. Alba! I really don't want to play these cards. Uh, oh, he actually did damage to me. How's he doing that? Oh, okay. Gotcha. All right. For you, pal, anything. 
And then we gotta do damage to ourselves. So... Whoops. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. Wise choice. Dang it. We won up to. So now we gotta do one damage. We'll just do it to Gabor, because we're just gonna bring Gabor back. I could shuffle out some cards too. But why? Why? So now we should have the extra card. We'll just murder you then. You should have that. And do damage to Arnold. Ow. And then everyone's gonna get an extra attack. Not that we need it. Okay, let's see if we can do this through this. So we're gonna do six damage. He's gonna boost by four. So this might take all of my effort. But we should be able to kill him. Yeah. Uh, and then do damage to him. Whatever, it doesn't matter. We must trust each other. Yeah, and then these guys get to go again. That's crazy. That's freaking crazy. And you know, I'm just gonna shuffle you back to be extremely bad mannered. <laughs> Who has the highest? Echo only has nine, even though I feel like we should I think you should be higher. I don't know if that's true or not. We'll grab you for the 17. I'm gonna grab you because I think you're higher than nine. Ow, oh, never mind. Didn't matter. All right, well, there you go. 167. Enough. I refuse <sighs> to die for these scraps. scraps. Well, it wasn't super overpowered, Me but you know, we still kept them to zero. Gently shackled the Nilfgaardian commander. A young nobleman with a precisely trimmed moustache. Like many noble Imperials, he spoke fluent common. The wagons. What's in them, Captain? Scrap, Your Majesty. The Imperial promptly replied. Noting the Queen's confusion, he elaborated. To be melted down and recast into arrowheads and spear tips. Our engineers Oops. originally planned to use the foundries in Broadhead, yet these proved too primitive. We were ordered to remove the scrap, take it elsewhere. Any pride from the victory vanished in an instant. Eh, I mean, we kept them from making he weapons. swelled with anger, but also with shame. The shame came from realizing that to the invader, her realm was naught more than a weak, underdeveloped backwater. Meave True. slammed the chest she'd opened shut. Blast it. Back to Broadhead. Let's ride. Crumbling walls, shattered windows, rotted wood. Broadhead was bleak, a dull shadow of its former self. As the Lyrians entered, the somber townsfolk glared at the arrivals <laughs> and uttered not a word. Neve resolved to address the crowd. Oh, Falcon hi. Broadhead, you're free at last. The Nilfgaardian occupation is done. Aye, and a new one starts now. Huh? Are you madman? Don't you recognize our banners? The Lyrian army stands before you. Oh, I recognize banners. Kill him. Served neath them as a sergeant 15 long years. Kill him. And then I came back to my own town. Know what I found? Hardship and squalor, your grace. All had gone to shite. On account of damn dwarves. Been flooding Rivia with their metal bits for years now. Or so <sighs> so much as light their pipes in their foundries no more. You call yourselves the Lyrian army. Colors and banners confirm it. Well, what about your arms? Weren't forged in us fires, but in Mahakam's by us worst foes. Hell, I even see some at knobheads in your ranks. So what freedoms it you're giving us, your grace? Freedom Kill to beg in common, not in Nilfgaard's mongrel tongue. Beg. What do you want about man? There's no levy on goods from Mahakam, but without it. As workshops don't stand a chance. And ye, your grace, ye wear their armor, bear their arms, and bring bearded bastards to our doorstep. Wow, way to be racist. Plug this man. The dwarves are faithful allies. They help us because. Because they've got so much to gain. Yeah, Simple flog them. Flog them. Flog them. Silence. Consider yourself lucky you've a merciful queen. 
Uh -huh. I'd have had your head off by now. Uh -huh. Move along. Before Meave could leave the market square, Barnabas politely interjected. <clears throat> uh, frankly speaking, there's a bit of truth to what the man says. I'm perfectly aware of that. But what do Is you he want? leaving us now? I don't mean to toot my own horn, but perhaps I might be of some help. Do you tell uh, okay. her I'm all ears. Everything your folk make here. The dwarves of Mahakam make twice as fast and twice as well. You must find a so-called niche, an innovation. And it just so happens innovations. Is it a tank? Give me a tank. Speciality. Give me a tank. At the risk of being immodest, exactly. Big iron tank. Besides, it might serve the cause of peace to show the folk here, non-humans are not all bad. That they can help, not just steal human jobs and piss in their milk. I'll consider it, Barnabas. I shall think and let you know. The time came to leave Broadhead, so Meave summoned her advisors, eager to hear their counsel. Do I have they to ditch him? Ideas, many of merit, but the Queen would decide the city's future. I'm entrusted to Barnabas. I'm entrusted to Barnabas. We don't use them that much anyways. After careful deliberation, the Queen approved Barnabas's uh... proposal. He would manage the city's ailing industry and seek to restore it to health. Barnabas, just please, do your best not to blow it all up. Don't you worry, Agris. <laughs> yeah. The only boom in this town's future is that of the economic sort. <laughs> oh, God. All right, that's fine. At first, the Rivian townsfolk were skeptical of the Queen's decision. But Barnabas's schemes bore immediate fruit. Soon the foundries and manufactories were bustling with life. Before long, Meave herself received new goods produced there. Sweet. Okay, that works. Now I'm no now I'm no ally of norms or any He's a bad apple. No uh, well, uh, sorry, but he is now in charge of you. Your city is spoken of Nilfgaardian victory as an inevitable blah blah blah. Remain vigilant. Okay, beware of traitors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, we weren't using Barnabas that much, so I'm okay. Milady, do you see the townsfolks, the Rivian gold thieves who protected the dwarves from Markham? They wish to repay you for your grace. They offer to share the spoils. Will you accept it? They have greater use for it. We have the. We don't need money, and we don't need morale either, but whatever. It doesn't matter. Okay, so we got um, probably just this puzzle battle, and we're gonna wrap the this episode up. The wind howls like a ghastly apparition. Get rid of this freaking banner, man. <laughs> I don't like it. Get rid of it. I don't think I can tear it down. Might as well go grab this because we're here. Not that we need anything. So, are we any weaker because we lost Barnabas? No, <laughs> not in the slightest. Not in the slightest. Well, before we do the puzzle, we are right here, so we might as well grab this. Is there anything else over here worth grabbing? Just a couple things up there, and there's this thing down here, which is whatever. So, yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, we can get that last card. We'll see. We'll see. We might have missed it in the first part, but... Don't be standard. Don't be standard. Don't be standard. Thank you. It's an actual puzzle. Once General Abde sees Rivia, he had ordered an immediate census of the conquered population. At first, many thought the Nilfgaardian had planned to raise taxes, but the truth was, in fact, must worse. Much worse. Before long, villagers and settlements were visited by slave drivers. There's no hiding from them. Eliminate slave drivers. Denali and unit die. Use your leader ability. Perfect. Can we use our deck? We know how to kill these guys really quickly. <laughs> uh. Hey, don't do that. Don't be don't be mean. Boost an ally by four, give it an armor, then trigger allies' loyal abilities. When damaged by the slave driver, damage the lowest enemy by one. You didn't damage the lowest enemy. He's immune. Mark a unit. Switch power with this unit. Okay. Okay. Give one charge. Probably him. The mist's gonna pass me those lovely earrings. Or do I tear them off myself? Huh? If the unit's power is higher than a slave driver, transform slave driver into a corpse. Oh. So we gotta get these guys higher than 10. Okay. I think I got this. Okay. Mm. 
We do this. We do this. Okay. You are going to go... Set unit's power equal to the unit on its left. So we do this. There's been a mistake. Go I'm here. No mage. You're not higher than 10, though. Hmm. Also, how are we supposed to get both these guys higher? I don't quite know how to work this. Because we needed this to trigger. I don't know how we're supposed to clean all three, though. Okay, so let's try this again. This one's a different, uh, difficult one. So I think what we have to do is probably bring this guy out right away. This artist. And maybe even do this. Because he's going to take a lot of damage right now. And that's okay. And then I think we need to play you out just so this guy takes damage. Because we want him to take the damage. Okay, then we play you here. Mark a unit, switch to this unit with this unit's power. We'll do this. And you're going to go here. So you're now at 12, which is what we need. How do we get more of these guys out, though? That's the only thing I don't understand. Because... Yeah, this is what I don't understand. So we can boost you right away. And then we can do this. Uh, end up Give you another right. one. Put you up to 21. Whatever. That doesn't matter. Oh, we can't lose any units. Gotcha. Frick. Frick, frick, frick. I don't know. The only thing I don't understand is maybe these guys continue on. So whatever. Let's put you out. Do this. I, if I would have just healed that guy, we would have been fine. Because there's no reason to get him higher. And then we wanted you to go here just to take the damage. Been a mistake. I'm no mage. Okay, you go here. Is gonna pass me those lovely earrings. Or I hit do I tear him off myself? Ugh, I hit the wrong friggin' button. Never talk to me about this. Uh, I forgot that it actually had a charge. So you go here. You go here. Okay. You go here. Fast. You've not seen me. Nope. I have not seen you. You do that. You go ahead and do that. In turn, we're gonna heal this guy. No way to move units, right? I don't think so. Left, right, left. Uh, what now? Might as well do this. Although maybe I should have played the A guy out. Yeah, we'll do this. There's been a mistake. And then you I'm get no set mate. to eight. Okay, now you're gonna kill. Okay. How the freaking heck do we do this? What the heck? This doesn't make sense then. Huh. 
Huh. If we played him out first, so then I guess we have to play you out first. I don't know what happens, by the way, when this flips. Maybe we have to do this then? Greetings. What is it? Put you up to 12? And then at least get you up above 10. Although we missed the loyal, which is unfortunate. So that means you will die probably. So let's put oh, another high powered asks, one out. You've not seen me. I'm cool with this. Alright, you're at 12. Hi. You're gonna come out. Let's set you here. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Uh, boost you. So we killed him, but now what happens? I don't know. Uh, pointy end upwards, right? Yeah, I don't understand. How are we supposed to freaking get these guys? Because we only have one of these dudes. We went here. You don't get any additional things, so I don't understand how this one works. I don't understand how this one works at all. Do not let any units use your leader's ability. We can't boost. And loyal abilities don't do anything. What was the name of this battle? And then trigger all allies' loyal abilities. The only one with the loyal ability, this is only the only one we can switch power with. And we can't do damage to these guys. What the freaking heck? What, uh, let's, I'm gonna Google this real quick, cause, I don't know, this one's hard. So what's the name of this puzzle? Workforce. Uh, okay, Workforce, uh, Throne Breaker. I don't want to actually watch a video of it. Rivia Puzzles. Workforce. During the fight, you cannot allow any friendly units to die. That's just linking me to a video, thank you. <laughs> that is not helpful. Thornbreaker of the Witcher Tale. Here's the walkthrough. Okay. Workforce. Puzzle. Put the Scythemen and use your leader's ability to strengthen the unit. Aye. Okay. Put Horse Thief next to Scythemen to the right. Put Horse Thief to next to Scythemen. Use Horse Thief's ability... On the slave on the left. And your turn. Put one of the alchemists next to the horse thief to the right. Put one of the alchemists next to the horse thief to the right. Use the alchemist order on the thief with one strength point as a result to the scytheman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, it doesn't really matter, but it's fine. You've not seen me. Use your leader's ability on the alchemist, which is in your row to increase the number to nine. Put the Lyrian hijack to the left of the alchemist. End your turn. Uh, pointy end upwards, right? On turn start, the slave with the left will exchange its power once. Put the second alchemist on your row. Then, in turn, use your alchemist order on the central right slaves, respectively. Wait, what? Am I missing something here? Yes, yeah, so you're exchanged. Put the second alchemist in your row. I'm an idiot. I understand. There's been a mistake. I no understand. I'm an idiot. Yep. Yep, I gotcha. I gotcha. I gotcha. I didn't think my brain never comprehended I could do that against the enemy. <laughs> I, I was like, 
I couldn't, I, like, there was no part of me that was like, oh, you can use this on the enemy, mostly because we spent most of the time not being able to do anything against the enemy. Man, we were so close on that one. I just was an idiot, so. All right, well, we're going to wrap this up. We are right at the finale. That'll be the next episode, so excited for that. Um, there might be a little bit up there, but we're going to see uh, what a tyrannical gameplay has done for us. Probably nothing too great. Yeah. I'm sure this is going to go not too swimmingly, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think as always. Hit the subscribe button, join the game, come in, show your support. It's going to be fun. I'll see you there. Bye.